Across the country, volunteers and organizations spent Tuesday helping people register to vote for National Voter Registration Day. Some people don't know how to vote. Some people don't know how to register to vote. The local Jackson branch of the National Alliance of Mental Illness held a drive through voter rally where they passed out registration forms and helped people fill them out. They said they chose to get involved because voting is a way to support mental health. It makes a difference who you vote for because they make the decisions when it comes to health care. Outside the Hines County Courthouse, Circuit Clerk Zach Wallace held a block party to make sure people were eligible to vote. Uh, I've been working down here for over 20 years and it's very surprising the, the group of people that's not registered. Um, it's not only the, the young teenagers, it's a lot of older people who never actually registered before in their life. Wallace says they're taking all CDC recommendations and precautions to help prevent COVID-19. They're also offering education and ways to ensure people their voices are being heard. And you can call us after the election is over to see if your vote counted or if it didn't count, we may tell you exactly why it was not counted. Anyone who will be 18 years or older before November 3rd can register to vote in the upcoming general election. Allie Ware, 16, WABT News.